Hey there, Shannon. This is absolutely a dream come true. I mean, look at this, the big boy. And I have the pleasure of being here with Ed Stevens. Thanks so, Dickens, thank you so much for waking up with us. Well, thank you for coming out. So you are really behind all of this. Tell me about your role and how you got this project up and going. Well, we, we started this vision back in 2012, and we were looking for a way, the, the best possible way a railroad could celebrate one of the most, the most significant anniversaries of a lifetime, and that's the driving the Golden Spike, 150 year anniversary of that. What better way to do it than to restore the world's largest steam locomotive? So my crew, myself, nine contractors, some helpers, and tens of thousands of men and women in the Union Pacific behind us we did this, we restored the locomotive from the ground up in two and a half years oh my gosh. so we could travel the country and just share the great American story about railroading, the history, the heritage of our country, steam locomotives, railroads, you know, how it changed the world, how it changed America, right. how it brought America together right after the Civil War. Yeah, it's really, really amazing. And as we take a look at all this, you, I mean, your hands, you built these, you and your team, because these parts aren't easy to get now. Yes, we did. We, we did this work. We had, we had some outsourcing of big machining projects, but every screw, every nut and bolt, every part of the assembly, we did it. Making these parts, machining these parts, hand fitting, drilling, welding, reassembling, 800 stay bolts on the boiler. That's, that's what holds the inside of the boiler together. All new tubes and flues. We rebuilt the superheaters. You know, I'm, I'm saying things that train, train aficionados know what I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah. Uh, new tires on the outside of the wheels. I mean, we went through everything. New wheels on the front, new wheels on the back. Everything that you needed to be new had to be new. Because this locomotive, it's not a museum piece. It's not just going to sit somewhere. It functions 100%. And this locomotive, 7,000 horsepower, 135 feet long, and look at how high it is. I know, it barely fits here at the it Amtrak barely, station. <laughs> we just kind of shoehorned it in here, 17 feet tall. I mean, this, this is just a tremendous machine. And that's really what captivates so many people's imagination. Because a steam locomotive, it's animated. You're watching it work. Yeah. So you've got this machine that's so big, and you're looking at everything. There is 550,000 pounds of weight on the drive wheels. And the main drivers themselves weigh 20,000, just one wheel, 20,000 pounds. So when you're going down the track, you can feel that. If you're standing next to the track, 25 feet away, you can feel this thing thumping and rolling along. It's truly, truly amazing. And I have to say, since you are the big man over here, Mr. Dickens, will you make sure we blow that whistle? Are you guys ready? Ready. All right, stay tuned for this. You can see it. It gets me so excited. Thank you so much.